with McAllister Hex Shank 230 volt breaker. It comes with a pointed and flat chisel and a carry case to get your job started. It's a cheap breaker, but can it cope with real jobs? The McAllister Breaker retails for between £130 and £150 in Screwfix and B&Q and that includes home delivery if required. To load a chisel simply place it in the body and lock into place. Now plug into an RCD protected socket and if using an extension make sure it's fully unwound. There is no need to add oil. I bought some grease but the instructions do not cover whether to use this, unlike other manufacturers. This breaker is heavy, weighing in at just over 16 kilograms. It has a 1700 watt motor so is reasonably powerful. It has a fan on the motor which you hear kicking in when in use, so it doesn't overheat for me. When in use on longer braking jobs you can lock the trigger on. This breaker is providing 50 joules of impact energy, so it's standard in its class. It has a higher vibration level of 22.04 meters second squared. It even has an anti-vibration system. The hex tool is 30 millimeters. In this review, I'm breaking through a garage floor of 14 centimeters deep in concrete. Whilst it takes several attempts, it does easily break the floor. Using the breaker to dig a trench, it easily goes through earth mixed with bricks. On both braking types, the breaker gets stuck and is difficult to pull out, but that is more down to technique. For PPE, I recommend eye protection, gloves and steel toe cap boots. When working in close confines of potential loose masonry, wear a hard hat. Ear protection is vital. So is this breaker value for money? Well, compared to the competition, it's cheap. The carry case breaks, but that's to be expected for the money paid. My logic on the value for money was to compare it to higher costs. I would have spent £110 hiring a better machine for a weekend. This cost me around £150. However, I can sell this for at least £100 on eBay when I'm done, so I feel I'm quids in. Besides, I found more jobs to use it for, and ended up using it for digging a couple of trenches. I would certainly recommend this McAllister breaker, and that comes from someone who doesn't like cheap tools. Leave your comments below on what you think. Please subscribe to my channel to stay up to date with our latest reviews and quick tips. Thanks for watching.